Hey guys, uh, <clears throat> so we're back with another uh, video tutorial for Kodi. So there has been a lot of changes recently uh, with the Kodi add-ons because of the TV add-ons not AG shutdown, aka Fusion. So I have uh, in the last video I have told you about Super Repo and use that instead of Fusion as a repository for your add-ons. And apparently as some people are having issue with, for example, installing or updating Exodus with uh, with Super Repo as well, because uh, Super Repo is still working, but some of the add-ons are not uh, working, or uh, you cannot download them, including Exodus. Okay, so it's always good to have a a backup. So today we're going to do another repo uh, similar to Super Repo, uh, but it it is working is brand new. Um, so we're going to talk about that. Uh, so let's go to settings on your Kodi. Uh, if you have watched my videos, you know how to add a source. right? So go to file manager. <coughs> so we have Fusion and Super Repo added here. So we can add a third one. The path is going to be, let's see if I can remember this without looking it up http slash slash media pros actually uh, I think the media repos. Like I said, it's hard to remember these URLs without looking them up, but we'll try. Dot net slash code Cody. Okay, this is, should be correct. If it's not, it's the box that can tell you they cannot add a source. It doesn't say that, so sh should be correct. So we can just leave the name as Cody Stuff or whatever you want to um, uh, mark it. Uh, it's actually the okay. So it's added. It's actually the Smash repo we are interested in on this server. So let's go back to our add-ons. Then we're going to select uh, my add ons. Actually, no. Uh, from add ons, click add ons. And on the very left, select this uh, box stuff, this installation. And select install from zip file. Select the Kodi stuff we just added. And this time you can select Smash Repo. That's the repo you want. So it's installed now. And then we're going to select Install from Repository because we, are, we just installed the repo from zip file. So right after you install this Smash Repo, it's going to automatically install something, that, which is what the box is doing right now. something that's necessary for the smash repo to work, I guess. So just patiently wait for the initial setup. See, something has been installed. Okay, so it looks as good now. Looks like everything's done. So we're going to select now, install from repository. And you can see all these uh, add-ons I had before, but the one we just installed is called Smash Repository. 
going to select video add-ons. You can see here, all the pop most popular ones are here, including One Channel, Exodus, Ice Films, although we have an issue with the Smash repo for Ice Films as well. It's, uh, you can try it, but probably won't work at this point. Stream all the sources are working, and the Royal Wii and the adult add-ons here. Okay, so all these are working. So the access here definitely is working. I just tried it yesterday. You can uh, update or install access from Smash repo. Uh, it is not working in Super repo at this point. Okay, so to show you it's working. Let's do video add-on. If we do <coughs> Exodus, if we long press Exodus, information, and select update, you can now see we have these different versions, and Smash Repo now has the latest version of Exodus. You can now update it. And the Super Repo, because it's not working for this for Exodus, it's showing a lower, a lower version. So I'm going to update Exodus. And it's updated. Okay. So same go goes with. So now you because without TV add-ons or like Fusion, you have to manually update your apps. So so basically you have to go on the screen like like what I did and manually check if there's a new version for your add-on and. Uh, update it either from Super Repo or from uh, Smash Repo, uh, as we mentioned. Like for example, if you long press one channel information update, you can see one channel is now updated in Smash, but not in Super Repo yet. Okay, so we can do this updating. It's updated. So yeah, just, just check your manually check all your uh, information uh, all on the on the app page from time to time, and just update them. And you can see this Smash repo, the new version of Ice Film as well. It's updated, but if you try to do a, do a fresh install, I find that it's not working for some reason, some kind of dependency issues. But and the updating is working because Smash Repo is working fine right now. So enjoy it while you can. I'm sure this at, at the rate the uh, Fusion and uh, Fusion and uh, Super Repo are going. This is going to be done soon. So enjoy it while you can.